Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy 3. We just got um, our boat and now we're exploring. So we explored this first town here and we're going to continue exploring. So yeah, let's just keep taking a look around. Oh, I should probably save. Um, I've died before and lost a lot of progress, so I'm just going to go ahead and keep it safe. Because I saw something up there. This thing might kill me instantly, so... You know what, I'm kind of tempted to see if it will kill me. But first, I guess, let's just see what we're fighting here. Um, just attack and see. See how on us. Oh! Oh yeah, I forgot, our dude is still with us, so... He'll be able to hit all of these. I guess we'll be able to see. Okay, they have a lot more health than 100, so that's good to know. Okay, but they have less than 300. Okay. They have around 200. Okay, good to know. So 130. So between 150 and 200. Which, that means they're not terribly bad. So, very, very doable. Let's see. What's... Okay, is there nothing in this corner? Okay. Oh, so we're all the way over here. So we've got a lot of forest here. Yeah, I feel like there's back attack. There's a lot we have to explore. So... Another village. Village of the Ancients. Okay. What is going on here? Turn to the other side? Okay. I'll just run back to the other side. Run all the way over here. Okay. I think there's a lady over here, right? Let me see if she has anything to say to me. Have you ever seen a chocobo? Such a strange bird it is. They make their home in the woods to the east if you wish to see them. Okay, we got an armor here. He's got better stuff. Okay. Mage robe. Ooh, I should definitely buy two... Ooh, a Kempo Gi. Oh, that's for the monk. Okay. Well, I have two mages, so we'll go buy two of those. Flame mail. Ooh, those are good, too. I'm gonna buy one. Yeah, I'll just buy one because I have the shell one on Luneth still, which is all right for now, so um, that's gonna be good. And I should, again, I need to save my money for a lot of other things too, so. Okay, this is a nice little town. Let's check out this building. We are the sons and daughters of the ancients, a once great civilization, but now we live by our land as rule commands. Long ago, our rule also charged us with guarding the Tower of Owen. Okay, this is the inn. Okay, what do you sell? Ooh, he sells. A lot of stuff. Um, we don't need to buy anything just yet. And we don't really need to use the end, so we're probably good on that end. Okay. I don't think there's anything down there. We'll double check once we go down, though. Would you believe me if I told you that the ground we're standing on this continent was a loft? Rubbish, you say. Well, it's nonetheless true. The Tower of Owen is a pillar. The pillar that supports our continent, built by the ancients to bring balance between light and darkness. Oh, okay, we don't have anyone dead, so... Nothing to revive. Alright, once built a great civilization, but were punished for their arrogance. This is the catastrophe we can all call the Wrath of the Light. They attempted to harness the power of the light. They arrogantly assumed there was nothing they could not do, but they had thought wrong. It is said that four warriors emerged from the world of darkness and stopped the destructive forces of light that our ancestors had conjured. But now it is darkness that has emerged, bringing chaos and destruction in its wake. And all we can do is wait for the four warriors to want to appear once again. Spells, yes. Give me some spells. Give me those. Um, I think those are level threes. Any level ones? Gear up. Uh, ooh, I need one of those. Okay, those are expensive, but I needed those. A rule. Okay, to be guided. Where is the last store? The weapon store. 
Okay, let's go down here. Oh, there's the weapon store. Okay. Light and darkness have their own will, a will that transcends that of the mere mortals such as you and I. They are perpetually at war. The crystals exist to bring balance between the two forces. When the balance tilts too far one way, the crystals choose four mortals and bless them with their power. Now that the balance is tilted towards darkness, four warriors of light will be chosen and tasked with bringing equilibrium to the world once more. Okay. That is it. Let's go through and see. Yes, let's get your last one first. Sight, zero, okay. And let's learn teleport. And let's sight. Hmm. Let's do that. Learn sight. Okay. Learn that. We'll get a full circle swords. We'll get all that. Let's see. What should we do on cam? Probably play. Like, Nickel sword. Nickel helm. Nickel mail. Nickel man. Okay. Put a meat hole. Okay. Put a man. I don't know if it goes yet. I'll keep that. And we'll click. For now, we're going to have to go without. Okay. Cool. Um, I don't know if there's anything much to do in this town. I think we just have to talk to. Ooh. We just have to kind of talk to him. I'll give you a prize if you run around the edge of the continent on a chocobo. Is that a challenge? And I think that's it. Oh. Oh. So I probably need to go to this castle. Because I, vi I visited both of these. I think the castle's where I need to go. Okay, so probably all of this is just walking space, so... Let me walk back to my ship so I can go to that castle. Ooh, there's a... There's a thingy inside the woods. Chocobos. Oh, I can ride the chocobo. Yo. Do I have encounters while I do this? Yo, this is sick. I could run around like the entire land like this. Oh, won't that kid give me something if I ride around? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and ride all the way around because I think that kid would give me something, so. I'm gonna do that. This might take a little while, but that's all right. I'm, I'm willing to stick this out for some sort of item. I, I think that old man was right. I think we're in the air. Oh, there's a village. Probably can't get to it though. It's actually kind of sick. And I think... Made it back to the town. Oh, I probably can hop off like this, right? Perfect. Okay, let's go talk to that little kid again. He might give me something. Oh, I think I need to go one more higher. Now, what will you give me? Incredible, you actually did it. Wow, good work. I mean, here's your prize. Gnomish bread. Okay, dude. <laughs> that literally doesn't help me at all, but hey. Okay, so I can just ba basically grab any of the chocobos. Okay, well, this will make it a lot easier to get back to the ship. Actually, I could... Oh, no, I was like, I can't. I, I actually have to have to take the ship over to the castle. I think the castle should be on the upper peninsula here. Yes, this is where we wanted to go, right here. Okay, before we go in... Like usual, give it a quick save. Make sure nothing crazy happens here. Castle Argus. Any secret rooms, secret doors? At this point, I'm just, I should probably just be checking everywhere I go because this game likes to do that. Anything hidden in the vase? That one. I knew it. There's something there. Okay. Let's see. What do what do we got? What do we got in store here? Ooh. Thousand G. Thousand G. Thousand G. Okay. More stuff. Thousand G. Hundred G. 100G, 
and 1,500. Okay, so that's around 9,000. Okay. Where does this take us? Okay, so there's one, two. <clears throat> okay, let's check out the right one first, and then we'll go to the left one. The door is locked. Um, can I? Can I use my thief to get in there? Let me get. Your thief abilities allow you to unlock the door. Okay, so I needed to get him up front. Book of Light, Fire Arrow, Book of Ice, Book of Fire, Scholar Robe, and an Ice Arrow. Okay, I'll have to apply those in a minute, but I want to see what's on this other one. Do I have to unlock this one too? Okay, so this one is also I have to unlock. Anything I can grab? Ooh. I opened the door with that. I was like, that one wasn't super cleverly hidden, honestly, so that's good. Light arrow. Killer bow. Oh, a new bow. And Medusa arrow. Okay, that's good. I didn't have to buy a new bow. I just earned one. Killer bow. Perfect. And iron arrow. Okay, so we'll just leave that. Okay, let's, what is these books that I just got? Book of Light. Oh, those are like magic use items, right? Sonic Knuckles. Right, so those will just be magic items that'll probably help me in a boss later on. And I'm actually, I'm gonna keep um, this guy out so I can, if there's any other doors, you know. But I think we won't use him again for a while, but I might as well just keep him on. Honestly, I think he looks the coolest out of all the characters, so. Uh, let's continue upwards. I don't think there's anything else to actually do here. But I'm going to keep running around. Okay, so none of us are dead. I could probably get healed up here, yeah. Okay. Alright, so I guess that's it for the castle for now. We got a lot of good items, which is good. But let's go out of the castle and I guess explore the rest of this peninsula. Got a little more to do. Okay, so let's head this way. Is there anything? I guess let's keep looking around. Wait, let me look at the map. Okay. I guess we'll just keep exploring until we find something, you know? Okay. Seems like there's nothing up here. So let's go down. Ooh, there's a cave here. Ooh, Golden Gulch. Okay, this is what I was looking for, actually. Any... Ooh, we got one from Sarah. Hello, Ingus. Uh, how are you doing? Father and I are both fine, as well as the rest of the people in the castle. Stop by and say hi if you have time. Okay. You are in Golgan Gulch. We Golgans are born sightless. However, we are endowed with the power of clairvoyance. We can glimpse into the future. That's wild. The crystal that gave you your blessing is the crystal of wind. You must go and seek the other three, the crystals of fire, water, and earth. I sense the power of fire from the island of dwarves. We live in this gulch, hidden from the world, for oftentimes knowing the future leads to misfortune. If darkness engulfs the world, everything will be consumed by the void. When the balance between light and darkness is broken, it will give birth to an unstoppable force that will destroy the world. Okay. Let's head down here. The earthquake was only the beginning. The great tremors that swallowed the crystals, the light of our world, only to spawn monsters from the depths of the scarred land, are nothing but harbingers of what is yet to come. The living wood, the seeping, the weeping trees are calling for you. Use the spell and enter the Tower of Owen to the north. Your, de dash, your destiny awaits. 
Okay, we got Toad. The Tower of Olin is filled with machinery. This is where Dash's destiny awaits. Uh, that's when the man who changes destinies will awaken. Powers of darkness have hidden the light from the remaining crystals. Okay. What can we explore over here? Is there items we can grab? Yes. Magic mage robe, ice staff, and a fire staff. Ooh, let's uh, light mage, so it's good. Okay, but we did get toad, so we're gonna have to teach that to somebody. I'm guessing, well, probably the easiest would be toad. Is this a level two? Perfect. So we'll need toad to get into the tower of Owen, which that's where we are headed next, so that's good. Okay, I don't know where that tower is, though, so... Oh, it's to the north, so it'd be... Uh, oh, it's another Chocobo station. Okay, that's good. Now I can run around and kind of figure out where everything is. Tower. Do I need to go and to... to oh, I guess I missed it last time. I'm kind of dumb, aren't I? Right. Let's go exploring. Frog? Oh, that's probably a sign that we'll probably have to use that spell here. Time to take a dip. We can't dive too deep in there unless we were toads or something. Toads? I hate toads. Don't turn me into one. Well, too bad. Toad. Everyone is now a toad. Might need to untoad myself, but I used all of my MP. Okay, so this time we're gonna toad everyone, but then we're gonna untoad everyone. And also, I didn't realize, but I could actually use the cast on um, all members as a whole, so I don't have to waste four points every time. So, okay, so real quickly, I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, Heal, and then I'm gonna use Toad, but I'm gonna use it on everyone. So that only takes one. Jump in, and then right away I'm gonna untoad everyone. There we go. So now I can actually fight back, which was the thing that I was lacking last time. Is there any like secret walls? No. Okay. Echo herbs. What are these things? Oh, he's coming in again. What a man. That was a good hit. 200 for that? Nice. Dude, we're doing some crazy hits. I'm down with that. Continue going up. Yeah, these enemies aren't super challenging if I'm not a toad. Which is nice. Okay, got these little goblin dudes. Um, Honestly, I'm just going to do the same thing. The other one worked out pretty well, and they do a pretty good amount of damage, even without magic. You just hit them with their staffs, and we're pretty much good. So, yeah, I'm good with that. Okay, before I go up... <laughs> what do you want? Creepy voice. <clears throat> Anything here? No? Okay, another battle. Oh, these are new. See, are these things damage? Are these things magic? It looks like, yeah, I might have to hit these guys with magic, but I'm pretty sure... The staffs also might do the trick. Or the sword, either one, I guess. Okay, so those things are a tiny bit stronger than the other ones we face, but... Not that big of a problem, either. <clears throat> you guys 
let's go grab this chest item. Which is a spark dagger. That is the second dagger we need to put on him. Alright guys, I'm going to end the episode off here. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and comment as for the channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.